some big news in the world of timeshare. That is Hilton Grand Vacations and Blue Green Vacations. What did they just do? Well, we'll talk all about it right after this. Hello and welcome to Destination Timeshare. I'm Jeremy. Today we're going to be talking about what Hilton Grand Vacations just announced on Monday, November the 6th, 2023, regarding an acquisition of Blue Green Vacations. So Hilton Grand Vacations, they're the ones that sell Hilton Grand Vacation Club timeshares, as well as Hilton Club and Hilton Vacation Club. Well, on November the 6th, they announced that they're going to be purchasing Blue Green Vacations. Blue Green, kind of one of the smaller, still fairly big. They do have 200,000 members. Well, they're another timeshare system with timeshares kind of spread around the country, kind of leaning more towards the East Coast. But let's read a little bit of the press release where Hilton Grand Vacations made this announcement. Hilton Grand Vacations Inc. today announced that it has entered into a definitive agreement to acquire Blue Green Vacations for $75 per share in an all cash transaction representing total considerations of approximately 1.5 billion inclusive of net debt the combination will broaden hilton grand vacations offerings customer reach and sales locations creating a premier vacation ownership and experiences company the acquisition is also expected to expand and diversify hilton grand vacations lead flow through blue green vacations world-class partnership including an exclusive marketing agreement with Bass Pro Shops and its unique base of dedicated outdoor lifestyle enthusiasts. Expanding Blue Green Vacations existing relationship, Hilton Grand Vacations also announced today that it has signed a new 10-year exclusive marketing agreement with Bass Pro Shops. So $1.5 billion seems to be actually be a pretty big premium, over 100% premium on the sheer price of Blue Green Vacations at the time the acquisition was announced. And in fact, it actually caused Blue Green Vacations shares, understandably so, to jump up over 100%. Now, Hilton was down a little bit, which is kind of understandable at least as well. But yeah, pretty big announcement here in the world of timeshare. So let's just give a little bit of a summary here about the acquisition. It increases Hilton Grand Vacations membership base from more than 525 members to more than 740,000. It increases the resort portfolio from 150 to nearly 200 properties in 14 new geographies and eight new states. So yeah, there you have 14 locations where there isn't an existing Hilton Vacation Club or Hilton Grand Vacations Club property. We also see it'll double the presence along the East Coast and expand the number of available outdoor and ski destinations. And we also here have that it's gonna save them 100 million in projected cost synergies expected to be achieved in the first 24 month following close. And you know what synergies means? It means a bunch of people are probably going to be out of a job because they combine the two companies. They don't need dual payroll. They don't need dual human resources, that kind of thing. So they'll be able to, you know, combine. A bunch of people are gone. They saved a hundred million bucks in two years. The transaction, which was unanimously approved by the board of directors for both companies, is expected to close during the first half of 2024 and is subject to customary closing conditions and regulatory approvals. So now we've covered the details. What does this actually mean maybe for you as a Hilton Vacation Club owner, Hilton Grand Vacations Club owner, Hilton Club owner, or even a Blue Green Vacations owner? Well, if you're an existing owner of Hilton Grand Vacations Club or Hilton Vacation Club, and you didn't buy into or not part of HGV Max, well, there's really no change there. You'll still use your week or your points in the respective system and just go about what you're doing today. Now, if you're actually in HGV Max, that is kind of the combined program where they're trying to bring all of these different systems together. Well, we expect that this will actually allow HGV Max members to book potentially into these blue green properties down the road when and if they actually integrated because they actually did specify in the press release here an opportunity to offer owners and members access to more vacations and experiences, including more resorts via HGV Max and across an even larger portfolio backed by the strength of the Hilton brand. So kind of expecting them to rebrand Blue Green Vacations in some way. If we actually look at a chart here that Hilton Grand Vacations actually put out a little while ago, you'll see in the list of competitors was 
Blue Green Vacations. They kind of had them in a mid tier, quite a bit below Hilton Vacation Club even, which is those old diamond resort properties. We'll kind of have to see where and how they brand these Blue Green Vacations resorts. Will they bring them up to a higher standard? They'll probably get some kind of Hilton name on them, whether it be Hilton Vacation Club or something else. We'll just have to wait and see for sure if you're a Blue Green Vacations owner when they get this implemented and integrated. They're going to try and get you to buy additional timeshare points, whether it be with Blue Green Vacations, Hilton Grand Vacations Club, Hilton Vacation Club, so you can become a member of HGV Max and you get all of the great things that come with that. And if you want to know more about what the difference is between Hilton Vacation Club, Hilton Grand Vacations Club, or HGV Max, all those acronyms, HGV, HGVC, I'll have a video right here coming up next. Check that out. Explains the difference between them and also what you need to watch out for if you're looking to purchase into any of those programs. And I'd also appreciate it if you could give this video a big thumbs up. Certainly does help out these videos. And remember, until next time, the best destination is always a timeshare.